Google seems to have a new game that they're playing with their subscriber base on YouTube. Now, let me explain something. I've noticed a drastic decrease in views in my videos from about here. Right about here is when I started copywriting my work outside of YouTube before I posted the videos. Now, it seems that any pre-copyrighted property that you're posting on Google through YouTube is being censored. Why do I say this? If we go down here, I mean, this is all pre-copyrighted stuff, stuff that I posted originally to YouTube before copywriting it with a source or a party outside of YouTube. And if you look at the counts, 90,000, 5,800, 15,000, I mean, just look at these. And then you go up to right around here where I started copywriting the material through Vimeo under my name before posting it to YouTube and there is a drastic drop in views on all of these videos. Not only that, but a lot of you who have, you know, I guess attempted to write me then went to the Level 9 News info at level9news.com to tell me or ask me, why don't you respond to any of my messages I'm sending you through YouTube via private message, whatever. This is why. This is my linked Gmail account to my YouTube account. As you can see, there's nothing there. I get no notifications of new subscribers, no notifications of new comments being posted, no notifications of private messages being sent through YouTube. So I want to advise or ask all my viewers if they have questions, concerns, comments, whatnot, Go to info at level9news.com and post your concerns, questions, comments to there. I'll get them, as I'm not getting them here on the YouTube platform. Now, I can only conclude, and I can't prove this, but the fact that the material I'm posting on YouTube's already been copyrighted and based on the EULA agreement that all of us had to sign when we joined up and opened an account on YouTube states that any property, intellectual or otherwise, once posted on this platform becomes the express property of YouTube, i.e. Google. My assumption is that if they can't make money off somebody else's copyrighted work, they're going to throttle the views. They're not only going to throttle the views, but let me show you this. And I want you to look at the number here, total number of views. This is, this is current, 35,982. And now I want to show you how I've been tracking all of my views and subscribers for quite some time, and I'll explain this in a minute why I've been doing this. If you look yesterday, yesterday on the 8th, I had 4,470 subscribers with 36,723 channel views or so it was posted on my channel. Today, this morning, I had an additional subscriber Yet my view count went down by almost 800 views for the channel. How does that happen? How do people unview material on your YouTube platform once they've been counted and accounted for the day before? This is almost, this is, oh, well, this is about an 800 to the negative view count discrepancy. Now, as I mentioned before, the reason I started tracking this outside of YouTube was I did a documentary, it was a three-part documentary, on the Gulf of Mexico. That video went viral. 
after the point it hit about, oh, I don't know, seven to 10,000 views, the counts stopped permanently on that video. Not only that, but several days after I um, posted the video and checked my account, the entire channel view count, which is up here, have been dropping by from anywhere from 500 views per day to 5,000 views per day as a result of posting that video. In addition, back in June or July, I tried posting three of my videos that I did on the AIJ2 software. I tried posting them on live links. And right after that, I received a private email from live links that my three videos were had copyright violations filed against them. So I checked into this more. Those copyright violations were issued and filed against live leaks by Google. Now, as many of you already know, I don't allow third-party advertising on any of the work that I post up here. So let me reiterate, as of about two months ago, I started to copyright my work outside of the YouTube environment and the Google environment. Ever since then, my counts on the YouTube platform have all but virtually died. So, in conclusion, I can only assume that if Google or YouTube can't make money off the work you're posting by claiming intellectual ownership to that work, to its advertisers, you will be throttled. I encourage everybody if you're interested in the type of work and reports that I do, that you frequent level9news.com. That's level, the number nine news, all one word, dot com. And if you have any messages, information that you'd like to relay, questions or contributions to the reported material being posted, please contact me through level9news.com. Info at level9news.com. I will respond as I am getting messages from people who are doing that currently. Thank you, and please share this video.